To get a better understanding of how air particles travel from their source to a monitoring station, the CTBTO is developing highly sophisticated models of global atmospheric transport in close cooperation with meteorological organizations. It is important to understand that the radionuclide released from the nuclear test explosion location towards our radionuclide stations takes place in all three special dimensions. So the radionuclides are transported not only in a horizontal direction, but they can also be lifted upward in low pressure systems, for example, or in thunderstorms, or they can be downmixed in high pressure systems or in the rear of a cold front. So to backtrack our radionuclide measurements to the possible source region, we have to describe the atmospheric transport in the same sophisticated manner on our computing systems. 